O oh, great spirits of darkness, we offer this life as a symbol of our devotion to your great power. May this knife release her blood to drink and her soul to devour. Cut! Cut! Somebody fix this. I want us ready to roll in five minutes. Ah, uh, Ogun, my friend. We've outdone ourselves this time. Voodoo Sacrifice Part 15 will be our best snuff film yet. We should wrap tonight, barring any further interruptions. Found something, my trusty mask hounds? Yeah! Uh, where am I? Hey, looks like I stumbled into America's kinkiest home videos. Hmm, check out that babe, she's... Yikes! Jill! I better do something pronto, or she's gonna end up with sushi! May this knife release her blood! Mind if I cut in? Okay, everybody, get your polyester out of mothballs! It's time to... Get down on it! Get down on it! Bluefish poison? Gee, I hope I'm not allergic to this stuff. <laughs> That was a gas! Let's do it again! Beavers, creepers! Where'd you get those beavers? On God! Be prepared to meet your mackerel! Ooga, finish him! Let's go! Hit! You win! Tails, you lose! Who was that masked man? Ah! Okay, Mr. Clean. I'm gonna wipe that shine off your head. Smoke it! Yikes! I better save Jill, or the next movie she's in will be My Sister the Blister! Bah! My snuff film is now in its ass! At least that nut will be fried! As they say, be prepared! Don't worry, Jill, we're cutting out of here! Hey, Jill! Snap out of it! Rise and shine! Jill, it's me! Eric! What's wrong with you? Please! Somebody help! I'm sorry, Mr. Martin. I've never encountered someone in your sister's condition before. She's totally unresponsive. I could only suggest keeping her here for further tests and observation. If you think so, Doc. Good morning, sugar. You know, I'm also a lawyer. Uh, thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Wow, I haven't felt this hungover since the last police convention. So, the word on the street is Big Head's moving in on Papa Croc's turf. Seems last night Big Head raided one of Croc's warehouse gigs, burnt it to the ground. This Big Head crazy messing with a big man like Croc. What a brick. Sounds like whoever possesses the mask is gunning after this Papa Croc. Seems like Croc rules the roots of the Orleans underworld, which means... Listen up, people! I'm looking for a killaway! That's me. Come along. Captain Dupree wants to see you. Here's your badge. You're lucky the bartender is a friend. Lieutenant, seeing that you are a fellow officer and a guest in our fair city, I feel that it is only proper that I cut you some slack and not press any charges. But Lieutenant, I warn you, next time I won't be so generous. I suggest the only hot water you find yourself in be a shower. Thanks, Captain. I'm headed for my hotel, but not before I check your records for the address of this Papa Croc. Jill, now that I've found you, I can't even reach you. But maybe the power of this mask can. Eric, no! That mask won't help her! You? You're the doctor from the shelter! Actually, I work here and volunteer at the youth shelter. My name is Jasmine. It seems fate has brought us together again. I'm here to help. Your sister's condition cannot be cured by either conventional medicine or that mask. Mask? What do you mean? There's no need to pretend, Eric. I sensed something odd about you when we first met at the shelter. Now, I realize I must have been picking up the mask aura. After you left, I heard noises outside my office window. Looking out, I witnessed your transformation. Look, lately I've been on a roller coaster of weirdness. All I want to do is help my sister. I know. So please trust me, Eric. The forces at work here are dark and powerful. To overcome them, we must first seek counsel. My grandmother, Bella. Yes. It was wise of my granddaughter to bring you here. I believe, from what you've told me, that your sister's under a voodoo spell. A spell cast by Papa Croc, the man you mentioned in the warehouse. Are you telling me Jill's some kind of zombie? No. Zombies are the dead brought back. Your sister Jill still lives, although her body is a hollow shell. Her soul or essence has been siphoned 
out and placed into a stone jar by Papa Croc during an ancient and forbidden voodoo ritual. As long as Croc possesses her trapped soul, she will be frozen in limbo as well as his slave. I'll just have to pay this Papa Croc a visit. Not so quick, Eric. Don't underestimate Papa Croc. He's truly evil. He's twisted the power of voodoo to serve his own warped cause. Croc was a vicious and cruel general from Haiti, where in his lust for power he raped and ravaged the people. Eventually he was overthrown, so he fled here, to New Orleans, where he met Ogun, a voodoo hitman. Evil attracts evil, so it was inevitable that these two servants would one day intertwine. Together, their venom has poisoned this city to its core. The most vile and heinous of their acts is the abduction of young women, such as your sister. These women, they steal their souls as offerings to the dark forces and sacrifice their bodies in their demented films to help finance their wretched underworld empire. Grandmother! Is she okay? Yes, she's resting now. My grandmother takes voodoo seriously, and when it's abused, it upsets her deeply. At her age, it's getting harder to handle. No wonder. This voodoo stuff can get pretty nasty. Actually, voodoo is really a force for good, Eric. My grandmother has taught me to use it as it should. To help, and to heal. Well, he may not know it, but it's time that Papa Croc was overthrown again. Be careful, Eric. Although it's our best weapon, I sense the mass power is tainted. Don't let its dark side consume you. I'm willing to take any risk to save Jill. What a spirit. And knowing how the mask works, it's only a matter of time before he shows up looking for Croc. Target sighted. Battle station. I won! Man, God duty stinks. Nothing ever happens. Add a change into something more appropriate for breaking and entering. Who decorated this place? Crocodile Dumb D? Ah, uh, Ogan. It appears we have a visitor. Apparently, the green headed nut lives. Let us give him a proper welcome. If you like this video and would like to see more, please consider supporting us on Patreon. Patreon.com slash self-pity entertainment.